a taxi driver or a person who goes to work and he's got his colleagues there, staff members there, can he say Merry Christmas? Uh, no, this would be impermissible. How th what the taxi driver should do is uh, when he meets these people, uh, firstly, very rarely do you hear Eid Mubarak from a non-Muslim, uh, unless they are very familiar with our religion. But when they are celebrating, uh, you can give them a gift, not on the 25th, on a different date, but not as a Christmas gift, with a different intention, and also, when you greet them, yeah. don't gr give the greetings of uh, the Christians. You give them the greetings of a Muslim, saying, we as Muslims are happier than you regarding the birth of Isa alayhi salam. And they will be surprised. Allah. How, Allah. how are you more Allah. happier? Say to them, meaning engagement is very important. Yeah. And taxi drivers are very good at engaging with their passengers. They should say, we celebrate Isa alayhi salam every day. Secondly, you have made Christmas a secular celebration. No longer is Christmas a celebration about Isa alayhi salam. It's a, it's a celebration about Coca-Cola and Father Christmas. So these kind of interactions are very important. And a person should interact in such a manner. And this is being realistic. Yeah. Meaning some people may say you're being unrealistic. No, by you not celebrating Christmas, you do not uh, endanger your job. Yeah. or endanger your status.